guys, today we are going to read the second chapter of Luke, which tells us the real story and the meaning of Christmas. So, I'm going to read the first five lines. The, the birth of Jesus Christ, chapter 2. In those days of decree, when to out from Caesar <clears throat> Augustus, that all the world should be registered. <clears throat> this was the first registration when Quirinius was governor of Syria, and all went to be registered, each to own town. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth to Judea. To the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the big house and unique of David. To be registered, Mary has betrothed, who was with ch child. Okay. Mary. Here. <coughs> Here. And while they and while they were there, the time came for her to give birth, and she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in a sword swaddling <coughs> swaddling cloth swaddling cloth and cloth and laid him in a major because there was no place for them to them in the in, <coughs> in the shepherds and the angels and the same ordinance the there were shepherds, shepherds. herds out in the fields keeping watch over their flock by night <coughs> and an angel of the Lord appeared to them and the glory of the Lord appeared, shone around them, and they were, hey, let me see, where are you, where are you, so, Just I bring you good. I bring you good. I bring you good news. News. Read it. Of great joy. Of great joy. Not that will be. That will be. For all the people. For all the people. For unto you is born this day. In the city of David, a Saviour, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign for you. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling cloths and laying, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was, there was with the angel of multitude of the heavenly Host praising God and saying, Glory to the God in the highest, and on earth peace among those with whom he is pleased. When the angels When the angels went 
away from them into heaven, the shepherd said to another, one another, Let's go over to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has known to us. It's Yeah. And they and they went with haste and Mount Mary and Joseph and the baby lion and a manger and when they saw it they um, they made known the saying that had been told them concerning concerning this child and all who heard it wondered at what the shepherd told them but, but Mary treasured up all these things pondering things in her heart and the shepherd heard returning glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen as it had been for them. And at the end of eight days when he has sized he was called Jesus, the name given by the angel before he was conceived in the womb. Jesus present at the temple. And when the time came for the purification according to the laws of Moses, they brought him up to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord, as it is written in the, in the law of the God. Every male who first opens the womb shall be called holy to the God. And to offer a sacrifice according to what is said in the law of the Lord, a pair of turtle doves, or two young pigeons. Now there was a man in Jerusalem whose name was Simon. And this man was righteous and devout, waiting for the consolation of Israel. And the Holy Spirit was upon him. Here. And it had, and is it had, and it had, and it had been revealed, no revealed, revealed um, to him, to him by the Holy Spirit that he would not see death before he had seen the Lord Christ, and he came in the spirit into the temple and when the parents brought in the child Jesus to do for him according to the custom of the law, he took him up in his arms and blessed the God and said, Lord, now you are letting your servant depart in peace according to your word of my eyes for my eyes seen, seen your salvation salvation that you have prepared prepared in the presence of all peoples a light for revolution and to 
the Gentiles and for glory to your people Israel. And his father and mother and his mother marveled at what was said about him. And Simon blessed them and said to Mary, his mother, Behold, this child is appointed for a sign that is opposed, and a, and a sword will pierce through your own soul also. So that thoughts from many hearts may be revealed. Um, it's over 35, 32, 34, on next page, 35, I mean 36, it's over here, and that was... And now was a prophet, Anna, he, the daughter of Hanuel, here is the tribe of the tribe of Asher, he was at once in years having lived with her husband seven years from when she was a virgin virgin again and then as a window until she saw Eighteen shipping with fasting and prayer night and day and coming up at that very hour she began to give thanks to God and to speak of him to all who were waiting for the redemption of religion. Jerusalem. The time to Jerusalem. And when they had performed everything according to the law of the law, they returned into Galilee, their own town to Nazareth with wisdom and favor of God was upon him. And, and now his, the boy Jesus in the temple, now his parents went to Jerusalem every year at the feast of the Passover. And when he was 12 years old, they went up according to custom. And when the fast was ended, as they were returning, the boy Jesus stayed behind in Jerusalem. His parents did not know it, but supposing him to be in the group went. They went a day's journey, but they began to search for him among the twelve, their relatives and acquaintances. And they, and when they did not find him, they returned to Jerusalem, searching for him. A forty-six. It's here. After three days, no, 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 it's over here. 
As the three days they found him in the temple, sitting among the teachers, listening to them and asking them questions, and all who heard him were amazed at his understanding and he answered and his answers and his answers and when the parents saw him they were astonished astonished and the mother said to him son why have you treated us so well the father and I have been hurting so deep in the grave this grave and he said to them why were you looking for me did you not know i must be in my father's house and they and they did not understand the thing that he spoke to them and when he and he went down with them and came to Nazareth and was submissive to them. And his mother treasured up all these things in her heart. And Jesus increased in wisdom and in stature and in favor with God and man. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like and share our videos. And remember, greatness starts with humble beginnings. Bye! And we're going to read chapter 3 next night. Bye!